Well, I am standing in a stunning garden and I'm here with landscape designer Elaine Hudson. How are you, Elaine? I'm fine, thank you. <laughs> so tell me about, th this is a breathtaking garden and it's quite large. Tell me about it and how long you've been doing it because you created this one. Right. It was designed 19 years ago and I was here for three years uh, from October to April when everybody else starts their, you know, their being busy in their gardens. Uh, I have to stop because the soil is sandy and it's huge and free draining so you know it just needed the rains. And we are out in Troutdale area right? Right. So we're the, and the Sandy River's right here so that would account for a lot of that sand so what did you when you got this place did the did the owner say I want this look or I want that look? Not really Linda just came out and she with an expansive uh, show of her hand she says Yo, you can do this. <laughs> <laughs> and how big is the, the, the garden specifically? Uh, I would say about three acres, wow. uh, but totally they have uh, 15 acres, I, I, I think. And there is, I hear there's a stunning waterfall here as well that you put in. This isn't a natural waterfall, is it? <laughs> no. When I walked in here, I, I looked at it and I said, what a wonderful place to have. It's an alcove. And somebody had done like a little grotto and spray painted it blue. So I found a guy who, uh, you know, to do it for me, I said, okay, come on, let's power wash that thing and get it going and we had a mountain lion come and give us his little footprint his paw <laughs> there like I okay this you know <laughs> well and there's also I mean there's so many beautiful things here uh, there's a wonderful gazebo that you had put in as well yeah uh, somebody did, uh, obviously put that in uh, because they used to have huge uh, company parties ah. and they had bands and stuff now it's uh, dedicated mostly done by Katrina their daughter for weddings they have weddings here, so. Well, you know, and the, the thing of this is, this is actually one garden on a great garden tour. So what we're gonna do now is take a walk over here. I'm gonna chat with another lady about the entire tour. Come on over, Lee. Thank you. So now I'm standing here with Catherine Deshone, and Catherine, you are part of the, the garden club that this is involved with. Yes, the Columbia Garden Club is established in 1946. And Catherine, what is the name of the tour? It's the East Multnomah County Garden Tour. This is the 20th anniversary of the garden tours. And one of the things I love about this garden tour is all four of these gardens are very large. How large are they roughly? Well, this one is actually 15 acres. Wow. This is the largest. The other three are at least one acre. And just briefly, what is, are, are there major differences in them or are they pretty similar? Just large scale. One of the gardens is a newer garden so the plants are smaller but they're all somewhat botanical gardens because they all have yeah. huge trees. And what is the cost to take the tour? Fifteen dollars per person. And are there, are there places they can go to buy the tickets early? Yes, uh, they can go to Al's Garden Center nice. and they can also go to Boring Bark and uh, they can buy the tickets there. They can also go to each garden oh, okay. tour uh, location and they can buy the tickets the same day. Well, you know, this, this one is absolutely breathtaking. I can't imagine what the rest of them must look like. So for more information, you can go to gardentime.tv. We'll also put a phone number there of Elaine so that you can call her and get more information on how you get the tickets and how the trip works. So these, these are really stunning places. Thank you so much for taking time You're welcome. to talk Thank with you. us.